Hey, good morning. Welcome to the 5 a.m. Master Scrum Show. Hope you're doing well. And uh, it was a late night. We went to a Phillies game last night. We got You show up, sometimes you get free tickets. So we showed up to a baseball game Sunday morning at 9 a.m. and ended up getting free tickets to the game. It looks like a bunch of other kids got to go, too. So it was a pretty fun evening. And, of course, Eddie spent all his birthday money in one instant. Anyway, I hope you're doing well. It is a Tuesday, and today I want to talk about sharing your profession. And um, we have the 5 a.m. Master Scrum Meetup uh, group that we have. It's on meetup.com. I just want to expand today the idea, because I've always believed this my entire career when I was a project manager, professional doing that, or engineer, or whatever I was doing. I always saw it. It was important to share with others to help them grow. And also, if you want the opportunity to grow, if you don't share, no one's going to recognize it. No one's going to be credit and you're not going to be able to elevate your career. So in this Tuesday, two for one Tuesday, where you try to 10X yourself, part of it's sharing, getting yourself out there and let people recognize you. I know it's scary sometimes, but it's part of the, the path to future right? To get that 10X, to grow your career, to reach up in the profession, to grow up on whatever career goal you have, no matter who you are, to be honest with you, whether you be a scrum master, agile coach, developer, tester, BA, uh, product owner, anyone, um, it's important. And on the meetup, we're offering people to sign up or send me a message and we'll get you in there to Share what you know, and I'd be happy to coach you through that process, too, if you need. And uh, join up our meetup group and take advantage of it, right? Because I'm going to say one thing, and we're going to go into it. It's important to have that experience in your resume for big conferences. So with that, it's 5 a.m. Master Scrum Show. I am Greg Master, Scrum Master and Agile Coach. And here we talk about Scrum and Agile in a very practical and tactical way. So you bring value to your customer. Not work hard, extra hard to bring that value and have a little fun along the way. And just to tap into that extra, that without working extra hard, a lot of presentations are just about what you present every day in your profession, right? You just need to convert it. Everyone says they do pres- presentations for the work and all. So why don't you do a presentation on, on topics and areas and things that you've done a little bit different than other people to the profession as a whole? And the 5 a.m. Master Scrum Meetup Group is a great place to practice that. It's usually, well, we do social media. When it does work, it goes out. Um, but in the meantime, it's usually a close-knit group. Get to try your presentation, practice it, use Mural, Mural, whatever, whatever tools you're using, see if it validates. Because it's, I'll be honest with you, it's difficult to judge how well your virtual presentation goes by yourself. Right, you don't know the settings and everything, and until you practice a few times, you don't. It's hard to get comfortable with that, and um, it's a great place to do that. I'm always practicing with that and sharing and figuring out what settings to do on the virtual stuff and everything. And until we get back, I don't, I don't know if it'll always be fully back, but you know, offering to people anywhere in the world. I mean, seriously, anywhere in the world, if you want to present anything related to agile, whether it be dev. Um, development, tech, uh, product owner, business stuff, scrum master, agile coach, anything related, manager, uh, please feel free to message me. I got a couple of people saying they're going to do that. So I'm going to bring them in to help present at one of our meetup sessions, work on their content. Because I have, let's say, evaluated presentations for Scrum Alliance. I've done not Scrum Alliance, Agile Alliance. I've done it also for um, the Agile Online Summit. And part of the evaluation process is to look at previous videos. If you don't have any videos from before that you've done stuff that like, we can see how well you present, you're probably not going to get as high marks in the content as you think. So this gives a chance to fill that resume. And why not put it on your resume too? Hey, I presented at the meetup, presented my topic, able to stand out there because let's say you are a scrum master. (laughs) Excuse me. And you want to go out and become an agile coach or an enterprise coach. Part of the activity is your ability to present material to 
the people that are around you. Um, and this provides a great video example of doing that. And we also put it on podcasts, by the way. So we put it up on podcasts later in video so you can share that and other people can hear your message. And maybe reach out to you. Maybe someone will find something that really resonates with, you, with what you do. And they may contact you for a job. Who knows, right? But this is something I've been a proponent of my entire career. When I used to mentor, I still mentor. But when I mentor people when I was younger in my 30s, and I had 20-year-olds coming out of college, so I'm a 30-year-old mentoring 20-year-olds. One of the things, because I was chair for a lot of conferences, meetings, professional groups, um, organizations, and I would present too. I would, I, I would, here's, here's my career path, what I did. I would go to a conference and say to myself, next year, I'm going to present at the conference, right? So I'd go to a conference and then the next year, something I presented at work, I would share and offer to present at the next conference. So I got the experience and recognition presented at a conference. Next thing you know, people are asking you to be the chair, a subcommittee or do this or do that. And your professional recognition grows, right? Now, one of the other things I also did too, I did too. Did you notice those words? I did to this to my, my, um, mentors my mentees that i was coaching is when they would go to the conference with me i'm like come on let's go to conference learn learn about the professional learn about other things learn about other ideas other thoughts what people are bringing into the table because they're not all yours by the way sometimes you get some ideas that weren't spurred from your own brain god forbid and i would have them go and then in a sarcastic way that i coach i like oh by the way you know, this isn't a free ride for you to go to New Orleans or California or Orlando or some nice place and stuff like that. Um, next year, my expectation is that you present something. So between now and next year, when we do this conference again, I hope you have some presentation and put some submittals. I don't know if you're going to make it, but why not submit your topics for the thing? Because I want them to grow. I want them to get them out of their comfort zone. I want them to be able to present. Because I'm going to tell you right now, if you cannot present, you do not get funding for what you want to do as your passion, right? So you have to be able to present. So we're building up. And that's why I built up this meetup.com. It wasn't just to do something. It was to provide access to experience for people who are trying to grow their careers. I've been through it all the time. I've noticed that there's a very limited number of seats, very limited number of opportunities. And I wanted to expand more opportunities for people to gain practice in that. So I'm opening it up. It's not a regional thing. It's a worldwide thing. Um, for anybody who would like to present, send me a message. Send them, you know, reply back to this video if you like. You can message me on any one of the social medias. You can send an email at connect at 5 a.m. Master Scrum or gmester at 5 a.m. Master Scrum.com. And I will get the message sooner or later. And uh, we'll set it up where you join or join the meetup group. See what's there. Experience it. So the meetup group's free. It doesn't cost any money. You can join the meetup group, attend the session, see what you like, don't like, see if it looks like something you might want to do. See if you get comfortable a few times, participate, right? So this is all part of your career group. So now when I'm doing this two for one Tuesday where we're trying to 10X your career, every one of the millionaires out there says you need to share content you need to share your profession and in fact if you were to get your pmp or any one of these things one of the things they require is that you do share in the community if you do not share in the community you could lose your certifications so there you go so not only you prep you put your prep time in there graduate get some credit you can put your time you presented and share with the community and get that credit, those those educational units back for your certification and renew them to keep them going. So I wanted to share that with you. Feel free. I got a poll up on LinkedIn if you're interested on both uh, my, my page and the 5 a.m. Master Scrum site that if you want to present, let us know. If you don't have content and you're kind of wondering what to do, reach out on my 30 minute conversation with the Slack group or something like that, that I have on my, on the 5 a.m. Master Scrum website, or like I said, send me a message. We'll talk it through, see what you got. 
see what you need, what you want to practice. If you want, we can coach you to that position. Um, but yeah, if you want to get promoted, you want to grow on your, your path. One of the paths to get you there quicker is to present in community forums, get the practice, get the recognition. So I wanted to share that with you. It's an Avenue doesn't cost you any money except for your time and a little bravery with, with presenting to other people. People say they're so brave. It's a different monster. When you present with people, you have no idea and you have no idea what their content is and their peers, other professions. You know, it's not like you're presenting to someone who doesn't know they know the profession. So it's a little, hopefully I just didn't scare half the people away, but they know the content, they know the stuff. So, you'll get some interactions, some challenges in that field and things like that. So I wanted to share that today because I think it's important. I'm, I'm reaching out, putting some message out there for people who might want to present and everything like that, because some people don't know how it doesn't know how to do it. Never thought, maybe they thought about it, but never did it. You know, it's one of those things. So I figured I, I, I would share that with you all today on this two for one Tuesday we're trying to 10 extra career. It's made me money over time. <laughs> I'll tell you that right now. Um, it helped me grow my career. It's how I got recognized. How's I got funded. It's how people would come to me. Hey, I got this. You, if I got this X amount of dollars, do you want it? And that's how I got it. So that's been my career on that. And I wanted to share that with you. Take care, everyone. I hope you, you're enjoying your day. Enjoy your profession. Sometimes it gets boring and you just got to go out and challenge yourself in your own prof professional world, even if no one else believes in the agile stuff, which is true out there, you know? So I'm going to wish you the best. Y'all yeah, have a great day and happy scrumming. And we will see you tomorrow. Take care. Have a great, and I guess I said have a great day again. Yeah. All right. Hope I'll see you soon on the meetup.com. Bye.